I have a deal with Darren that, you know, if, if Darren wants to speak to any club, I'm, you know, 17 years ago, I stopped him speaking to, I believe it was West Brom, I can't remember. And we had a bit of a fallout over that, you know, and it was, they were much, you know, they were higher up, they were doing yeah. great. And me being young and ambitious and, and silly, thinking he'd want to, you know, not talk to somebody. So I got the hump when he wanted to talk to, you know, another club. So I, we always had disagreement. That, look, I would never stand in your way, you know, particularly if a club of a certain size comes in. And Charlton, no matter what you say, where they are, they're a big football club. Yeah. Um, so I rang him. I just quickly filled him in and said, look, he said, look, can I ring you back in two hours? And then I was like, for fuck's sake. So I was then stressed about that. Mm -hmm. um, but he rang me in two hours. He just asked me a couple of questions and, you know, about our plan. And, and he was like, you know, I'm, I'm really happy with what we've done. Are you still good with it? And because, you know, a lot of it's been Im implemented by him and his staff and, yeah. you know, and, and we gave him all new contracts and looked after them because of what we're trying to do with the, with the way we play and, and the age. And I just said, absolutely full steam ahead. 